Hey, how you doing? Welcome to another episode of Squared Circle Forward. Today we're taking a look at SmackDown 2. Know your role. Uh, really love this game back in the PS1 era. For mine, this is how a wrestling game should feel. It's arcadey. It's a little bit superhero-y. Uh, it's got some depth. There's a lot of game modes. Um, it's got some full motion video. Um, which is basically ripped from the show. It felt like SmackDown. It felt like SmackDown was in my head. It's really exciting, really fun game. Uh, we're going to just kind of watch this for a little bit and then jump right in and see what it's got. Uh, we'll kind of run through a couple of exhibition matches and have a look at maybe the creator wrestler feature as well as a couple of the other things it's got. Um, yep, it's got Rikishi's ass. That's why it had a good game. Oh man, so uh, nostalgia from what this era brought. But uh, look, let's just jump right in. Undertaker. I actually like the Undertaker in this American Badass role. But all right, let's jump in and see what it's got. If you haven't seen this before, it's a good one. Okay, SmackDown 2, know your role. Uh, we're playing on the PS1. We're going to experience some load times and some memory card usage. Uh, it's just the way it is. Uh, so if you haven't seen this before, uh, Squid Circle Ford is where we just take a look at a bunch of wrestling games. I really love wrestling games, and there are a lot of wrestling games to have a look at. Uh, this is our third episode. Uh, we've had a look at WWE Superstars from the arcade, and we've also had a look at WCW Nitro on the N64, which was not a good game. Don't get that game. Um, apparently the PS1 version was a little better, but uh, nothing. Uh, okay, so let's jump into an exhibition. Oh, yeah, there we go. Anywhere full. I'm going to go... Let's look at some special matches. Hell in a Cell, like Iron Man, Ladder, Tables, Logan. Let's go a... Let's go a... Hell in a Cell. Okay, here we go. Who are we going to choose? Undertaker, Vince... X Park. I'm gonna choose, or maybe I'll snow. I'm gonna choose. Let's just choose the Undertaker. He was a good one, and he is going to go against. Give him some Chris Jericho. Uh, didn't have full entrances, but you'll see that soon. That's kind of a mixture of um, real video and kind of the in-game engine. Pretty cool though. Still like the entrances from No Mercy a little bit better. Are you scared? He's here. Beautifully rendered bike. a little bit worse than I thought it was. It's still cool. Alright, let's see. How we go. Load times. This button, this game uses uh, the four face buttons, shoulder buttons. Oop. I've got myself a grapple attack. Got myself an attack button, which depends on, where, on, on which way I push up and down on the D-pad. That's how it works. I've got myself a run button. Let's do 
pick him up here. This one choose this one. The cage does get in the way a little bit in this in this game mode. Let's send him up top. Computer ain't that smart. You can uh, you can turn off the extra camera angles. Ah, come on, grab him. All right, suplex. So these uh, your special moves indi were indicated by a SmackDown icon that pops up over your name. Let's see if we can get one going for the Undertaker. Let's see if we can get a last ride. There we go. Nope. Nope. Oh no, I pinned him. No, I didn't. There we go. Jericho's coming back. All right, let's pick him up. Oh. Here we go, last ride. I'm gonna see if I can get out of the cage. There we go. Oh, look at that! Undertaker's on top of the cage! I wonder what's gonna happen. <laughs> Come on, Jericho. This seems to be this weirdly placed middle section of the cube. Which might be... Let's do it. Gotta get him over here. Come on, uh, come on, Jericho. Come over here. Here we go. Put him in the right spot. There we go. Although, although he just gets back up. I mean, you know, because that happens. It's just a really good fast paced game. Oh. oh, I forgot you could do that. Yeah, the tombstone pole driver was um, turned from a... Where do I pick up that? Turned from a special into a just a regular-ass move in this game. Oops. Let's see what this one is. Oh. My suplex. So that's right and grapple. And what's left and grapple? Ah, choke slam. Cool. And we'll give him uh, left shoulder is SmackDown move. And pin is. Oh, what's pin? Down and grapple. Two. Could feel. It felt. Like I said, it felt like SmackDown. Although I want The Undertaker to celebrate on top of the cage as he's his want. Let's see what other game modes they've got. Yes, I'm sure I do want to save. Saving. Um, I. I own SmackDown and SmackDown 2, but I think I spent most of my time playing SmackDown 2 in the end. Seems to be the one I remember the most. This game, I think you can unlock Stone Cold Steve Austin as an unlockable character, but I don't have him unlocked on this memory card. 
can't remember how to do it exactly either. Uh, let's have a look at another exhibition. Let's go. Let's go. Single. No, let's get tag match. Okay, well, I'm gonna go because uh, today we found out that Matt Hardy has left TNA. So we're gonna go the Hardy Boys. Where is he? Where are you? Well, uh, there's Jeff. Oh, wait, which one's me? Which one's the other one? I assume it's this one. Well, we'll find out. Matt and Jeff. And we will go... Oh, I, know who we, I know who we should go. Bubba Ray and Devon up top. This could be bad in the end. Oh. Oh, I don't get any... Let's go for the Tag Team Champions. Of course, we're gonna win. We're gonna we're gonna send the Hardys home as tag unless they're already tag team champions in this save, but I'm not sure. Takes a while. There we go. Oh, they are. Then we're gonna retain the tag team champions. Heads are, heads are a bit square. Wonder what he's going to do after TNA. Hopefully we'll find out who's the next to be deleted. I doubt they'll go to the WWE. I think he's after a little bit more creative control. Ooh. Barbara's glasses are coming through his face a little bit there. Oh, Devon's are as well. Uh, mine aren't. Mine are fine. All right. If only I could remember the tag button. But we'll figure it out. All right, um, I'm pretty sure we only had the one ring in um, the game, so there's not really that much to choose from. Although you can do King of the Ring modes. I'm pretty sure it's still just played in this ring. Oh, early, early pin. The things I have found that I always seem to forget in these games is the focus button. Okay, what do we got? That's the move I was after. Have... Oh! Missed it. Get up. Great camera angle there through Matt's back. What's the, what's the last grapple move I've got here? There we go. A little twist of fate. Oh! Oh, that's just part of the course with Jeff Hardy. I don't know where he's going. No, oh, he's gonna get the hand to tag in the front of the Oh! Keep away from Devon. Oh! Pushing him over in the corner, which I don't, I don't really want. Almost got my SmackDown up. I think mine is the Senton Bomb, which you would assume it is. Come on, one more. 
Oh, no, no, no. Turn around. Oh, popped a little. No, it's gonna take. There we go. Let's go quickly. Oh, I just got straight up. He didn't sell that at all. Oh, probably right, not selling it. Sent on. He's gonna be trouble backstage with Vince. Oh, they, they, they did a really good job with what they had to capture so much of the spirit of this game. Oh, that, ah, screw it. What are you doing? <laughs> and like I said, I don't know how to focus. Oh, no, can outs. This is no good. Now it's the... Oh, well, hopefully that retargets me a little bit. Nope. All right, how do you do it? There we go. I don't know what I did then. I think I just hit way too many buttons. Ow. Let's pin him. No. Oh. Let's go tag. How do I tag? No, nope. what am I doing? Jeff's just, just, just got him on his own. Why am I attacking that? This is not very well designed. going well. I'll start it off well for Jeff Hardy. There we go. Dude, Devon's not selling either. Oh no. This isn't going at all well. How we? Nope, there it is. Oh, nice move. There's so many little kind of really interesting moves that you find in the middle of these games. I forgot that move was even in there. Rana. Alright, we got a Salsa. Can I do it from up here? Oh, that's a cool move. Hurricane run off the return button. Bubba Bomb. Real Press. I don't know. I didn't know, really know he could even do half this stuff. Oops, missed him. All right, let's get him there. Last one on, and then we'll pin him in. Oop, nope, no, we won't. I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna figure out how to choose Matt Hardy. There we go. Matt's in. Oh, Matt cops it. <laughs> Cop there. All right. What's, what are we gonna? How's this gonna work? On tag. I forgot that if I tag out, I don't get control back. It's 
so I just kind of sit here and watch. This is no good at all. There we go. No, welcome back to my side. Maybe I can call for a tag. Oh, I completely forgot about this. This is the, probably the worst part of the game. Not. I hate it when they don't give you back control. There we go. Like, we're, we're coming in. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Hey, I figured out the button for <laughs> moving direction. Nope. Nope. Right, right. Nope, that's bad as well. Alright, let's get out here. Oh, didn't work. Fine. So, if anyone asks, it's right to is the button for changing focus. Well, the bubble road just seems to be moving out of my way. I'm asleep. There we go. Let's get let's, let's figure this out. Not the ideal spot to do that. I'm just going to taunt in here. Oh, Barbara didn't like that. I'm going to snap Mare. Matt Hardy. Come on. Senton, I'm in the wrong spot. Get him. One. No. Was that, was that a rope break? Just, or just too soon? The thing about this game as well, it's all flooding back to me. It does seem to get into this weird stalemate position where I feel like I should have won by now. And... No, I could have got my special off. Oh, there you go. Didn't have to beat him at all. The only way to make this game better is if there was a nut punch and a ding noise. Nut punches and ding noises, to me, are the pinnacle of wrestling games. This game doesn't have that. But we will be looking at, at one of those that does have it in the future. Uh, I do want to save that because the Hardy Boys retained their tag chart titles. Uh, let's go and quickly take a look at the Creator Wrestler and then we might just do a quick last match and then get out of here. I'm not... I was always petrified of removing memory cards because I only had one and it had... and it was a big memory card and it had every single save game I had on that. Where are we? Create a superstar. Uh, let's go quickly. Appearance. I remember I made Sting using this, or as best I could. Originally, um, new. We will call him. 
Uh, just kind of look like they've been inflated with air. Let's go regular. Um, looks like a very skinny King Kong Bundy at the moment. Let's have a look. Oh, advanced head. Face. I can unlock noses and things. Cool. Let's go. That one will do. Oh man. That's just got a bit of a beak. It's kind of hard to... That'll do. Here he goes. Eyes. Sure, he looks mean. Give him a bit of variation. That's eye color, I believe. Is it? Wow, it's creep. It's creepy. Eye length? No. All right, there he goes. Mouth. Let's give him a bit of a. Let's give him that bottom lip. Whoa. Looks pretty. He looks like he's been through a couple of fights. Base hair. That's amazing. Oh, look at that. He's like a a ginger, but with the extra bits that go down the sides. That's gonna. I can't. I don't. I can't. I can reckon I can get better than that. That's pretty cool too. Oh, he looks like a... Makes him look like he's, he's a gangster from the, the 30s. That's, that's going to be it. I wonder what these figures are. Oh, oh, oh. That's a unfortunate head shape. Oh, that's what it's going to be. And it's going to be... Variation. Alright, sure. There we go. Blonde pointy head do. Looks like a reverse triple H. I don't think he needs needs any more forehead hair. Oh, this is amazing. Let's give him nope. 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 Sure. Oh, let's go back to those ones here. Where is it? There we go. No, oh, I still like that profile. Um, sure, we're gonna go. Actually, let's go down. That'll do. Look at that. He's a classy dude. Oh, don't tell me you get to put back hair on too. Let's just go really long at the back. It's quite frankly the worst mullet I've ever seen. Where's the color to match? I don't even think there is. How do you match that? There's not even a button to say, let's match what weirdness you've. Oh, hang on. So I go that and then I make that brighter. That kind of works. Oh, look at you. That's fabulous. Uh, I'm just going to quickly go through some facial hair here. Is there a long beard? Nah. Come on, give me something. That was Eddie Guerrero back there. Oh, that'll do. He looks like he's a happy dude. Good enough color. Accessories. Oh, he's not going to... Uh, I've looked at some paint. I don't think you can see any of the paint through. 
Yep, that's the it. That's the one. It's fabulous. Accessories. What? Oh, okay. No, this is... Like I said, I made Sting with this. Probably probably with that thing there. Um, Sure, let's go that one. That looks great. Sure, let's go mask. After all that work, we're gonna cover up his beautiful hair. Oh, it doesn't. That's even weirder. That's great. That's the mask. Colors are perfect. Mask accessories. Oh, don't tell me it goes on the top. I'm into this. Oh, what happened? My mask go. Oh no, let's go back to the this the basic top perfect. And we're gonna give him horns. Cause it's all <laughs> That's dumb. Oh no, side ones. No, these ones. The bigger the better. Oops. This seems like the the type of gimmick Vince just would give someone as a joke. I'm only interested in how a hat's going to fit on this hair. Ah. Uh, and they're all just caps. Yep. He's just a Mexican wrestler who's a big fan of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Sure. Nah. Those glasses are pretty perfect. Done. Decision. I can't see that being any better. That worked out well. Upper body. Let's go quickly. Although advanced seems to... Base. Uh, what type of... Pectoral muscles. I think a little bit of hair. And he's got a tattoo, and hopefully he can have a stone called Steve Austin. Oh, nah. I'm almost too excited here. Can't. Nah, it's got to be a front one. I love wrestler tattoos that happened way before they became famous. Because they're always... The way I see a wrestler getting a tattoo is that they're traveling around a lot, they stop at a town, they're bored, and there's a tattoo place there. There's never any pre-thought to it. In my mind, that's how I envisioned it happening. Uh, let's give me a front photo. Sure, he likes to play cards in the back with the boys. He's probably a bit, you know, good at cards because you can't see any expression through that. Sure, he, he's a bit of a hippie too. Oh, hand length. Does that change the... Great. Because if there's one thing classier than a tie-dye t-shirt, it's a long sleeve tie-dye t-shirt. No, don't know. Can't see. Too much hair. Oh, no. I don't even know what half this is. Let's choose. I like this. Like they're specifically placed over the nipples. I'm sure I could spell some things. Like you can't just do it. Oh, here we go. He is a big fan of the Rock. So sorry, Stone Cold. So we will have Stone Cold T-shirt. 
It's like a Mexican Steve Austin fan who's become a wrestler. Uh, we're gonna... Nah, we can't cover up that beauty. Alright. Uh, let's just quickly go into... I reckon that's good enough top. Uh, we're gonna go some pants quickly. Let's just go standard. Uh, no. No way. We're gonna go... Short pants. Oh no, hang on. They're too short. I want them kind of mid. There we go. How about this? Long skirt. <clears throat> Great. Perfect. I like that. Done. And... Sure. We're done. Nah, weapons. Let's give him a weapon. Uh, his weapon of choice is the... It's gonna have to be an iron pipe. I feel, I feel that's the way he would go. Oh, edit man. I'm really happy with edit man. He's gonna be called Ed edit man's a great name. Especially for a guy who looks like that. The piece de resistance of this game is the fact you can choose a gender afterwards. Actually, it should be... You know what? It's a mystery. I, f I feel that's the best way to go. And the... And he is a part of Generation X. Uh... I don't even know what we're doing here. Crowd signs, sure. I reckon his fans love Cactus Jack. Decision. Um, enter yes. Oh, enter yes comments. Sure. And to know, ah, oh, is this for? Uh, he's a light heavy. No, he. I like to think he has no personality. I think this is all for season. Uh, I reckon he's a speedy little cat. Sure, stick some defense in. Man, he's fast. I reckon that's all he's got. Sure. And he's... Let's just see how he goes. I'm gonna throw him into a match. Uh, auto... Sure, he's speedy. Wow. If I had time, we could do a whole... Cool. I gotta find him. Edit man. Let's throw him into a match and see how he goes. Let's see how Edit Man, the new WWF superstar, goes in the ring. I can see him having his own t-shirts. Edit man. Edit man. He uses the t-shirts of all the other wrestlers. That's that's what I think his gimmick is. Let's do a quick one and then we're out. Thanks for watching, by the way. Thanks for watching the birth of Edit Man. Uh, no, let's see if we can find him. Uh, let's go to exhibition. Let's go single one-on-one -on -one so he's not obscured. No manager. Adam man don't need a manager. One player. How do I find him? How do I? Where is Adam man? It's in the bottom? There he goes. Edit man. I like the fact he's all in caps as well because I didn't know anything. And he is going to face The Rock. Because what better way to introduce a new character than to put him up against The Rock? It worked for, for Chris Jericho. It's going to work for Edit Man. It kind of looks like Chris Benoit. Oh. 
I didn't choose his music, did I? Did we choose an entrance? This is exciting. No. Are you ready? Oh, we did. So that's what that meant. <laughs> Edit Man is in his purest form. He is just every single superstar. He's kind of like. Uh, oh, who was the guy who took other people's? It's kind of like Gold Dust. Just a more explicit version of Gold Dust, because he don't care. Rock put on some weight here. He was at wrestling weight here. Enough, you know, bulk so that he didn't get injured. Not as cut as he is now. Okay. You ready? Let's see Speedy Edit Man. I don't even know what his moves are. How's he even move? Uh oh. Oh, Adam has on the ropes, literally already. Oh, get up, get up. How does he do that in that skirt? I think in modern day wrestling, there is a lack of wrestlers from parts unknown. I like the fact that all these moves should not work with a skirt. We're going up. Come on. There we go. That clip like a motherfucker. I want my special. I wonder what my special is. I don't even know how to do it. We're not giving him underwear. This could be. This is. Oh, it's, that, this is fine. This isn't the PG era. It's all good. It's a really mixed bag of tricks this guy's got. He's almost got his SmackDown move up. It's kind of a Jeff Hardy type arrangement. Or just generic. Come on. Oh, it's got a submission move. Oh, brilliant! There you go. Thank you for your time watching the birth of Edit Man in SmackDown 2. Know your role. It's an awesome game. You should check it out if you haven't. I'm sure you can find a cheap copy around on a PS1. It's great. Uh, thank you for watching Squared Circle Forward. Uh, stay tuned for more episodes. I'm going to save this because that's Edit Man's first ever victory. Uh, create your own Edit Man and bring him to the top, to the top of the heavyweight division. Uh, anyway, thank you. This has been Squared Circle Forward. My name is David Shack. I'm from semiinformatic.com. Visit there if you want to see any more Squared Circle Forward episodes. Uh, I will see you another time. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Bye.